Well, hello, hello there. Welcome back to Devaness. Let's go. I feel I think this is par four. Yeah. Um, what did we do last stream? We went through the cemetery. And uh, we found a few bo mini bosses, I'll say. Maybe bosses. We fought the gatekeeper and the gardener. There were tough fights. It was fun. But now, right now, I'm a bit lost, to be honest. Uh, <coughs> I am... Uh, what a nice way to start the game. <laughs> Alright, so... I don't have a map. So I'm on the house in the cemetery. This is locked. Yeah, let's go outside. So we're in a house where the crossbow is. Um, but I cannot take it because I need to solve this puzzle. And I have no idea. I need to introduce uh, a date. I know Domini. The year before the Lord. What is the year before the Lord? I don't know. And then there is this fire here. Uh, some kind of supernatural fire. Did they use it for something? Mm. Yeah. I'm not sure what to do. Is there any other puzzle I can solve? Let me go to the portal really quick. Let me see what items do I have. Because I think I have... Mm. I don't really have any key items. <laughs> we had to farm four medallions for that big chapel thingy. We have the piece of paper. The lighter. Mm, I think that's it. There's, I don't have any keys. I don't have... Oh, this is the painting I was thinking about. But I feel like I'm being watched. She doesn't look at it. But those symbols on top of the painting are the same as that on the, on the uh, gear puzzle. So let's see. I have... Oh, first aid kits. What? What? Oh, it's there. Okay. Empty antique paper. Antique paper. Maybe let's try that. Let's try that. And the lighter. Maybe I can light the fire or something. I will do something. I have no idea to be honest. <clears throat> um, I'm gonna leave the knife in case we find some items, and I will just go like this. Here we go. I'm thinking about previous puzzles, the mansion keys I don't have, the sapphire keys, the sapphire gates at the garden, I don't have them either. Um, the pyramids on the other dimension, I'm trying to think of everything. There is some gates with symbols. Oh, and there's those, those puzzles with like the three symbols and the levers, but I have no, I have no idea what to do with that. I can't even travel with that. So, mm, let's try the lighter on the campfire. Maybe it will burn or something. No, and the piece of paper is not gonna work, right? Oh, it does work. Alicia used the empty. Oh, it's burning. Strange note. Oh, maybe this. Oh. Okay, so these are the symbols from the puzzle I was just talking about. In this place, we plant the seeds of life so that beauty may bloom among the death and strife. Okay. Subterranean structures house the history of the dead. Only the living may enter here to oblivion, they will be led. The trees grow where the souls test in the earth. Their roots dig deep, using death as a new birth. 
Okay, so there is three. Yeah, we have seen like a total of three of those puzzles scattered around. So I'm guessing depending on which place they are, you have to do a different combination. Oh, so this is just the text from the notes without the drawings. Okay. Okay, in this place we plan this. So the beautiful uh, among the death and strife. Among the dead may be the cemetery, right? Subterranean structures house. Do we see any of these puzzles in any underground location? Maybe one, yeah. The trees grow where so uh, the roots it live. Riddle note. Okay. Hello, Polygon. Oh! What the hell? Yo, 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 chill, bro. Shotgun. Oh! Oh. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, there's another one coming. Uh, <laughs> I regret not having my knife now. But if all of them woke up, it's gonna be a lot of zombies. How many? One, two. I hear another coming. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Came out of the closet. Yeah, that zombie was like, I didn't do it in life, I'll do it in death. Okay, uh. Got him, three down. There's still one more. I don't want to waste all my shotgun, I mean my pistol ammo, so I'm gonna use two shotgun. Bro, is this guy gonna- Yo! Okay, he's not close. Oh, there's two more, fucking hell. Boys! Oh! Ooh. Fucking get wrecked. Double kill. Nice. Bro, I tried collateral so many times and this is the first time it worked. Okay. Two with one shell. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Alright, so... I guess we have to go to those riddles. But... Let me see that map. Wait, did I ever check the left side of the house? Wait, wait, wait. Did I ever go this way? I don't remember. Mm, there was a dog, but I but I went back, I think. Oh! Hell yeah, brother! It's like a cage. A dog cage, maybe? Anything here? Anything on the trash can? Anything on the dumpster? No? Okay. How are you, Polygon? How are you, man? Good afternoon. Good morning, afternoon. Let's see. There is one puzzle here. What is that singing? Good? Bro, my game is lagging already. Freaking hell. I'm fine, I'm fine. I was doing some meditation and stretches. Cook a little, clean a little, and I'm good to go. All right, so... Can I move this? Oh, now we can interact with it. There's a strange sort of mechanism. Will you use it? No. So we are on the dark forest. Okay, dark forest is gonna be where the trees grow, right? The trees grow where the souls rest in the earth. The roots dig deep using death as a new birth. Nothing works. Huh. Well, let's go to a different puzzle like this. Actually, I can take the... Wait, all the trapdoors lead to these puzzles, actually, right? Do they? I think they do. So, that's good. So, we go from here to the other side here. Maybe I need the three of them, but... Man. Maybe I need a second note. To get it right. Okay. So this is the garden. No. The garden. <laughs> no, this is the first one. This is the seeds of life. Yeah. 
Wait, do this, does it change when I move this one? Does it move the other one? No, it doesn't. Oh, I got it. You don't have to even check. All right, so we got this one. Oh, oh, look at this. We got one out of three. So this is to open that door. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we're doing it. What is Trey Arc? What is that? Uh, was it? Was there another one down here? So this Terranian, this underground is just to go from one to another. That makes sense, though. Because if you have to walk, that'll be a pain. Yeah, here we were. So we are on the ruins. The ruins. Subterranean structures. How's the history of the dead? Only the living may enter here to oblivion they will be laid. And the middle one is that. This one is gonna be hard. Was it that one? Oh! Loon Artist! Thank you for the follow. Welcome. Let me see. Uh, a game studio that has that logo. Do you know which one I'm talking about? Treyarch? He has that logo? Yeah, it sounds... It sounds... Uh, it, it looks familiar. It's like a very common geometry shape, right? Call of Duty? Oh, Trey... Oh, okay. Those are the, the guys who make uh, Black Ops? But that's Infinite Guard. I don't remember. Uh, let's try combinations. So, we have Triple Triangle. I'm okay, thank you for asking. How are you, though? And are you looking for this game in particular? How do you find it? <laughs> okay, so it's none of these. We're gonna switch this one to... Uh, that one. Nope. 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 Okay, let's try this one, then. Come on. Oh, you're Fred. Oh, Rebelloon. Okay. Oh, you're on Fred Discord again. Why are you using a different Twitch account? I was going to literally ask you, like, how were you, how were you doing? And I haven't seen you on Fred's stream in a while. So, yeah. I was wondering if you were okay. Okay, so if it's not that one, that means... Let's try... This. You have to leave the puzzle. You have to leave the puzzle to see if it's correct. You cannot check it like that button I'm doing, like click, 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 click. You cannot do that. You have to leave the puzzle. And if it's correct, it will lit. That, that, that's why. I, I was getting it right, but... I was getting it right, but it didn't. Okay, I get it. You cannot check it while you're pressing the levers. That's the thing. So we we'll go. Which which way do we have to go now? This way, for the dark forest. I forgot. Okay, 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 okay. I was gonna say, man, like there's no way. Uh, dark forest was. Um, triple dot, triple triangle. And it cannot repeat the symbol, so it will be very easy to, to find. Well, it has to be this one or the other. It can be only be two possibilities. That one. Oh, well, it's the other one. Then. All right, it has to be this one. Okay. Man, why will they let you press the button to check the puzzle? But then it doesn't work. All right, so now we can open through that door. We can go through that door. That door is... Unlock the door to the old tower. New area. Sanding speaker cables? What is sanding? Oh, oh, what the... He's back. Alicia's memory 8. No, 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 no. Can I run from this guy? 
to his side. Okay. Oh, this is where they were performing the the baptism. They said on the know, right? Oh, sandpaper. Oh, you're like cleaning them, making them work again. Nice. Do you buy new headphones lately, Polygon? Because I remember you mentioned, like, I'm fixing my headphones. <laughs> well, we got a new memory. Let's read it. Memory 8. I'm finally getting a sense of just how huge the mansion property is. I've been trying to get through this massive, sprawling maze of a garden, encountering new kinds of horrifying creatures as I try to find clues as to what happened to, the, to Emily. On top of this vile new creature, something totally different is chasing me. I get the sense he is unlike any of the older creatures that I have encountered so far. He displays cunning, intelligence, he's incredibly strong, and he doesn't seem to be phased by bullets. It almost seems like he's protecting something, trying to scare me off. Is he connected to Emily's disappearance? No, my headphones are fine. I just took that speaker out to certain people that stopped to talk outside my window like while I work. I, I feel I get you. I that happens to me. That just happened to me 10 minutes or 20 minutes ago. There was like people in the window. Ah, here we go to the old tower. I was scared there when the gatekeeper came to me because last time we fought him. He blocked all the doors and exits, as in like mandatory fight. But this time we could run from him. So I'm glad. Oh. Oh. Is that? That's us. No. What? Oh, that. That's Alicia killing. Her husband and daughter for the ritual. Maybe she's bound. She made the the bounding ritual to the master. <gasps> Are you ready for the key master? Do you know this game, Polio? Is the key master an enemy coming or something? <laughs> There's something here. Emmons. So we are on the catacombs. I thought we were gonna go to an old tower, but okay. No. I'm making Ghostbusters reference. Oh, okay. I didn't know that reference. There's a note here. Except from the journal of Dr. Arnold Howard. September 1st, 1981. September 84. September 28th. Daylight. <laughs> that was just it. Everyone, everyone was playing Resident Evil 3 because it's September 28th. I'm still alive. I once again bore witness to another one of their depraved rituals tonight. Recently, they had moved me out of the, my guest room and into a subterranean chamber beneath the mansion. Lord Alfred, the one I have come to know as the Master has allowed me to witness one of their special ceremonies, what they call the Blood Rite. This was conducted in the sacrificial atrium beneath the mansion, although to me it looks more like a dungeon. Surely what I witnessed was a, a hallucination brought on from the nightshade plant. We were all required to consume prior to the ritual. I watched as one of the cult members was executed before my very eyes. A prayer was said by Lord Alfred himself, who proceeded to cut himself and mix his blood with that of the deceased member. By that point, I was beginning to feel the effects of the delirium, which I only partook in to gain their trust. So it is hard to distinguish reality from hallucination when I describe what I witnessed. An hour after the cultist died, I saw something quite spectacular. A form rose from the dead body, which was bound to the dungeon wall by a chains and pulleys. A sort of shadow. A dark veil that blossomed from the corpse and morphed to take the rough shape of a man. All the other cultists bowed before it in awe, with Alfred seeming to struggle to keep it in control. That was when 
all hell broke loose. This shadow thing began attacking random members of the cult, burning their skin and causing them to convulse with seizures at the slightest contact. <gasps> that was when I was ushered uh, out of, dan of the dungeon and back into my living quarters with no explanation as to what I just saw. I have a feeling I'm going to need a fa a f I need I'm going to need to find a way to escape this place soon. <gasps> This reminds me of, uh, there's a story called, uh, I think it was called the Blackstone. The Blackstone. Uh, story. No, what is, what was it called? I think it's by Hogwarts. It is the Blackstone. Yeah, there is a story by Robert E. Hower, which is a very famous writer. He was friends. He was a very good friend of H.P. Uh, Lovecraft, and he made a story called The Black Stone. And he, this story here is so similar to that. So similar. The Black Stone, flat Earth evidence. <laughs> you, you, you. You doing goofy sounds now? <laughs> Okay, so we got ointments. What else is here? There's a few items here. So are you telling me there is a freaking something here? Elevator gear. Oh, well, there is no electricity, though. We cannot take that, but we're going to leave this. Take this. Wait, what? Can't leave these items here. Are you fucking trolling me again? Why do you troll me like this? Mutley? Is that a, I don't know that one. Is that a character from any some cartoons or something? Oh, I think I fucked up. Because the game is telling me to save, right? They're giving me a gramophone. They're giving me a vinyl. Yeah. I feel like the game is telling me to save. And they're giving me heals and ammo. Cartoon dog? Sounds familiar. He has a particular laugh. I mean, the way you write it, it reminds you of Goofy. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Okay. Mm. But you cannot leave any items in this place, so I can not save. Oh, you can't? What the fuck, man? Uh, whatever. I'm, I'm gonna save. I have a lot of saves. I'm not gonna be ready. Oh, I see. A wizard laugh. Yeah. Bro, I've been playing for 40 minutes and I have not done shit. I haven't I all the thing I did is those puzzles. Alright, here we go. Here we go. I opened the gate, I did a thing in four two minutes? Nice. Should I be proud of that? <laughs> I end the stream now. See you guys. Enough progress today. But this is locked. There, oh yeah. I every time there's blood, one of these guys appears. I was like. Die. Get banished. Yep.
Believe it or not, I'm gonna go back and refill the, the water. Oh, I need to take this. I believe taking those serve not purpose, but only in, game, in new game plus. I'm not sure. I'm gonna leave the gear. Maybe I need the elevator gear for the end of the dungeon. But there is a portal at the end there. Yeah. Well, I would like to take that. Even even if you take it and leave it on the ground, it's worth it because then you can retrieve it. But if you don't pick it up in the first place, you cannot retrieve it from the from the ma magic cube. This place is spooky. Are we playing Amnesia now, guys? No, 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 no. Hmm. Ooh. Oh, shit. There's a portal here. Lots of items in this dungeon. Oh. Oh no! Oh shit! <laughs> okay, game. That's scared the fuck out of me. What is this? Bro, they're giving us so much. <laughs> they're giving us so much. How is this thing? I wish I could have saved here instead of put it sleep, but whatever. Alright, let's prepare for the fight because holy shit, man. They're giving us so much shit. The question is, should I run from that enemy because they're very slow? Or should I kill it? Because my, my concern is, what if I try to run to save ammo? But then I get another enemy right after and they sandwich me. And then that's... There is no escape from there, you know? So should I be greedy or should I play safe? How many bullets I have? 19 shotgun ammo? I'm gonna run, fuck it. Fuck it! Leave me alone! I'm shaking all the cells. Ah! Oh, it's gonna be one of those guys that are gonna appear on the portal. Every time there's blood, I'm not gonna get close to the blood. I'm gonna avoid the blood and it will not spawn. What about that? 200 Q. Uh, that door is closer on the other side, so. I'm gonna try. Oh, what the fuck? Oh! Ouch. Bitch slap. I need something. Oh, no. Okay, okay, it's open, it's open. I thought I needed that special key or something. Oh, there's another one here. There has to be some important item or something, right? No? Huh? More bandages. Explosive bolts? What? Explosive bolt, uh, bolts. Wait, this portrait, that man, I could have swore I've seen it before. Alicia was a hundred percent. Is this who the cult is worshiping? The master? Wait, oh god, it's all coming back now. It's him. What do you mean it's it's all coming back now, Alicia? Can you can you go can you explain to us? Elaborate, please. Exactly. Exactly. It, what do you mean it's all coming back now? What is coming back? Alicia's memory 9. Oh, we need the fucking elevator gear. I knew it. There is so much occult symbolism around this place. What, is all, what does it all mean? I keep having to solve puzzles and try to get a better understanding of the esoteric nature of this place. I have somehow found myself in what looks like a catacombs. 
or an underground crypt. I know now the human-like beast that relentlessly chases me. He is the one that brought me to this damn island in the first place. He seems to be some kind of caretaker or gatekeeper. I have managed to elude him for now. I found an elevator down here. I don't know where it could possibly go. To the tower. Well, got to go back. Okay, he's on the middle. Fucking camera. Fucking camera! Uh, <laughs> sorry. I was screaming. Alright, here we go. Elevator. Is this elevator gonna take me back to the mansion? Because I remember there was an elevator on the mansion. But it's saying they have power. So probably it's a different elevator. Or maybe now that we put the... The gear, maybe we give it power. No, I think it's gonna be the elevator. So we're going back to the mansion. Why though? We have we don't have anything there. We don't have any keys. We don't have. We have nothing, bro. Yeah. Okay. Now what? Now what? Ah. Wait. Did did the map change? Hold up. Why is this? Why is this red? This door was locked by someone. Okay, so the mansion has changed. The mansion has ch changed. There is a portal there now. What the fuck? Lock shows 203. It was not 203 before. It was 640, I believe. This door is open now? This door was not open before. It's the cube mansion. Oh, it's changing like the cube. Okay. The rooms are changing. Oh, shit. A broken wheelchair. Totally not a Silent Hill reference. And the elevator isn't working. Looks like the electricity needs to be turned back on. So there's a jet... Get another elevator. I don't have my knife. Fucking hell. Hmm. Too much ammo. Fuck you, mate. <laughs> we need the Ceres key, bro. This game keeps giving us more and more and more and more uh, puzzles, but never answers. Looks like it's jammed. I really like this mansion. Look at the walls. Look at the... Everything is like deteriorated. Hey, you gotta... You fucking... Got him. I love big camera angles. Look at this. This is pure art. I love this a lot. I love this shot. I'm gonna take a screenshot. Like this. With a shotgun. You're more badass. But she 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 kind of looks like when she's carrying the shotgun, she kind of looks down, so I'm not sure if I like that. Yeah, you see how she's looking up now? What about no weapons? Empty handed. <laughs> Boom. Oh, let's keep going. There is another room here. There's a lot of rooms here, but I, I, I want to kill the zombies first. Before I go into any rooms. Uh, Pluto. So we have Sun, Moon, Pluto, Ceres. We have all the all the planets and small planets. Oh, a piano. A piano puzzle. There is blood on some keys. I really wish I had my knife.
You fuck it. Motherfucker. Okay, I need to heal now. I right, put me on fire. Did I kill him and remove his attack? Because it was like that shit coming to me. And then he stopped coming to me. Needs to be locked from the other side. Okay. I don't like when games do this. When game presents to you puzzles and then they change the map suddenly. And yeah, it's kind of weird. Wait, wait, wait. All this liquor reminds me of William. I'm guessing William is Alicia's husband and Emily is the daughter. Okay. He was married to the battle more than he was to me. After what happened to Emily, hmm, there must be a party here. All these bottles are empty. I don't have the knife, man. I should always carry the knife. It's just too useful. Alright, so... This, so I'm guessing I need some music shit or something for the piano because the game will the game will not even let me try any pressing anything. So let's go through a different door. So it's locked. So let's go through the one to the left. <clears throat> we never went this way. I'm gonna very quickly go for the... I'm exploring, basically, now. I'm exploring. I'm gonna go for the knife. Because I'm gonna run out of ammo if I don't. And I believe there's a portal up here. So... We can take it very fast. Chin, 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 chin. The story is kind of interesting so far with the whole cold and sacrifices and rituals and blah blah blah. A little bit cliche so far, but maybe. I need to grab Jet another heal. I think we're fine. I really hope we find the crossbow code soon, because I really want to shoot some motherfuckers with the crossbow. Yeah, we're gonna have to explore the whole mansion again, but let's go step by step. Let's go room by room. The crystal is missing. Hmm, someone took it. Let's go room by room. Or my brain will not be able to take all the puzzles. <laughs> Need to be methodical. Look at this summon model. So cool. Yeah. No! Start the running. Then they have three different speeds. They have like slow, medium, and fast. And when they're on fast, it's very risky. Oh, that was too close. There we go. Who's playing the piano? Imagine a puzzle where someone plays the piano and you have to hear the notes and then reproduce it. That would be fucked up. I mean, unless it's very easy. Oh, it's, it connects with that corridor. Okay. What is this place? So this below the chandelier. More ammo. Have it. Turn on the flashlight, girl. There's a zombie there. Nothing else here. Maybe we have to drop the the chandelier and break this thing on the ground. Yeah. Let's go upstairs. We got some ammo. Worth. Oh, let's go back to the main hole. Hmm. What are we doing now? Let's see. Let's go room by room. These two doors. This. 
This room was not open before either. Bro, Alicia is getting strong. She be capping some arms. It's gonna launch. Okay, I'm gonna shoot him. Got him. I have too many items though. It says dark room. A dark room. That can mean different things. Uh, what is that noise? Where are there flies? A Pluto key. Oh! Oh, shoot. I think I'm gonna run away. Yeah. There is nothing else there, I think. We got the Pluto key. Okay. The Pluto key. That was on the other side that I came from, right? Let me check very quickly this room. Let's not assume. Hmm. And we get to listen to Moonlight Sonata now. I look at this. This guy. It's beautiful like, in rooms like this too. Before I go to the Pluto key, I'm gonna check the rest of the rooms on this hall. So let's check the second floor too. Bro, my shadows scare me there. <laughs> let's see if we can do anything with the chandelier. Mm, maybe I need something to cut the chain. Pliers, bolt cutters, you guys know the deal. Every game has a crowbar, a bolt cutter. Oh shit. I, I hear more zombies, so I want to get rid of this guy quickly. There's more, but I'm going to try knife and pistol. But I, I just don't want to get sandwiched. I think the other one is coming the other way, though, so... Yeah. Oh! Oh, that guy's dead. Boom! Oh! Nice try, man. Why is that painting upside down? Oh, this was too risky. Uh, he's running. He's running. I like I like the the chum the thumbies change the speed. They ma it makes them unpredictable and it surprises you sometimes, you know? Sometimes you're on like, on like fighting mode and then you're on like more like running mode. And it's it's cool, you have to adapt. Okay, where the hell are we? Wait. 
I'm confused. Oh, I'm on the second floor. Am I? I'm, I'm not sure. Bro, where the hell am I anymore? I'm not sure. No! Who's this? Going faster! It's going faster! It tried! Bro, that guy's getting wrecked. That's probably the best zombie I have killed with a knife. To be honest. This door is open. So many paintings here. A sun. We still don't have the sun key. Bro, why are all the paintings down upside down? I don't know. Maybe. Oh, hello. No. Mm. Two shotgun first for a zombie. Not worth it. But it's okay. Both arms, yeah. This shotgun is strong, man. Okay, there's nothing here. We need the uh, the sun key. Um <laughs> uh, Let me see if there's the elevator. So the elevator is there. A Pluto key. Okay. This is a safe room? What is this? What is that? Shotgun ammo and a note. Let's read the notes. Strangers note two. Day one. I'm so glad me and Ursa decided to book a stay at the Master's Mansion. God, I had no idea this place would be so big. I'm very excited to be initiated into his program. Our friends and family kept trying to tell us that it was a cult, but this is nothing like a cult. The brochure labeled it as a spiritual retreat, where one can go to get in touch with their true self to reach total self-actual actualization. So far, we have been receiving received with open arms by the other program members. I can't wait to finally meet the master. I hear he can speak several languages, and he and has the true secrets to anti-aging. Day 2 So Ersa and I have been exploring the mansion throughout the day, and we noticed something odd. The entire interior of the mansion uses gas lamps as it pr uh, its primary light source, not a single electric bulb inside. This means at night the mansion tends to be very dark, to add to that, there were certain areas of the mansion that were strictly off limits to us. I guess that's not so strange. Anyone with a home this big is bound to have a room or two reserved for privacy. Ursa is starting to get a little spooked, but I think she's just homesick, and the dark nights are getting to her. Tomorrow I might ask one of the initiates if there is any way we can get some additional light in our room. Man. No lights! Back to the 18th century. Day 3. So I think we might decide to cut our stay short. Ers it's it's Ra. Seems very uncomfortable here. We split up earlier to go walk around the mansion grounds. And when I found her again, she was ranting about seeing some kind of monster in the goods, simply out of her mind with weird. To my surprise, the senior program members reprimanded her harshly for exploring the outlined premises without one of them to chap it on her and gel, head, gel at her to never do it again. My feelings about this place are starting to change, and I have to see any hint of the master around. Oh shit. Any any spiritual retreat ever. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Day 4. We're just getting ready to leave when the master summoned an emergency gathering at the church on the hill. As I write this, I hear the bells tolling in the distance. We have everything packed, but we came all the way to see the master, to learn of his incredible knowledge. I can hear them knocking outside our door, insisting I come with them. And I can't see to find Ezra. She's been missing since this morning. Oh, 
Oh shit, you fucked up. You fucked up, boy. Okay, so I'm gonna leave this. What is this item? Nebra Moon. Nebra Moon. Uh, as I make half featuring what looks like the Nebra Moon. I have no idea where that goes, but we need two halves. So I will leave it more like in the middle, in the main hall to, to be able to access, access it quicker. No lights, just wire uh, LED. To a Lugo solution with graphite and zinc on the poles. That is that game gonna give you energy to to lit up. Let's lock from the other side. This door is locked. Earth. Okay. In that case, we're gonna go back. Oh, that door is locked too. Wait, what? Okay, so we cannot go back to the mansion. Hmm. So it has to be... There is another Pluto lore here, right? Yeah, there is a Pluto lore here. <clears throat> Wait, it was not this one. Did I check this? No. <clears throat> Do I need to get anything else? There's an item there. A, a shiny item behind this guy. Look at this fucking face. Pistol ammo. Oh, I need that for sure. She's looking at something there. You see her face? Hmm. Weird. Uh, let's drop... Uh... I don't know what to drop. Each cell at least 1.2 volts. If you put graphite and zinc, it will do like a, some kind of a reaction. But electric mag electromagnetic reaction and it will lit it will lit the LEDs. Interesting. Uh one second. Oh game. We can leave this seal. Where did I find the ointments? Wait, what? There. All right, that's good. This game, you have to play a little bit like Resident Evil, and then a little bit like sorry, you have to play a little bit like Resident Evil Zero, and then Resident Evil One. Wait, where was the, the Pluto key? It was all the way down here, right? Because you have to, sometimes you have to drop items on the ground, and then other items, other times you have to s storage them. Even a strip of carbon fiber will work. Okay, now I know what to do if I run out of lights. But who has those those things? Mansion F one. Oh, and we can connect to the second floor. This place. Something feels off here. I don't like it. There has to be a way out of here. <laughs> Those comments. Those comments from Alicia. I, 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 I don't know where I'm going. Okay. Oh, shit. It's puzzle time. Bro. 
<sighs> they are presenting us too many puzzles at once. What is the door? This one I cannot lock from the other side. Birth of Zeus, the gods of gods. Oh, they have dates. Maybe they tell us what date is what. Mm, Rhea, representing Cronus as a stone wrapped in cloth. Hmm. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Hell yeah, brother. So the four these four ascendants look like look to be guarding an angel. There is a message here. Because of what you did that night, this place shall be your grave. The guardians cannot protect you forever without their shield or faith of faith. Each guardian is represented by a number. There must be a meaning behind this. It looks like something round can be placed here. Maybe the moon the moon crest thing, right? Interesting. So maybe. Hmm. Once let me take notes of these numbers, I guess. I'm not sure. I, I guess I will have to change the numbers when I put the crest. Oh, well, we can take notes. Zero one seven one. In any order, really. But those four numbers at least. Okay, so why is that? Why is that shiny thing there, though? Down. Let's go back and let's go upstairs. Did I check everything here? Yeah. Looks like most of these paintings have been taken down. Yet another coffin. This one is filled with candles? I wonder if they tried to resurrect the death. I don't like this place. It radiates evil. And it's not filled with candles, Alicia. Do you know the differentiation between filled? Okay, I kind of locked this door now. Uh, this one is locked. This door looks like it leads to the balcony. The lock is jammed. There's a circular adaptation in the door here. I think something can be placed inside of it. Uh, this one is for the moon, I think, because it looks more rounded than the other one. I'm not sure though. Wait, wait, wait. The lock on this door looks rusty and brittle. So it's gonna break when I go past it. I mean, I have to, right? I have to. There is another way. Oh, hello. Oh my god, bro. Alright, okay, 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 okay. No! He is one till a little nibble. Wait, I know where I am. I am outside. Yeah, yeah, I know where I am. This room. Okay. This one goes to the statue, right? On the TV. Let's go here first. Yeah. Anything different? This door is locked. It seems someone left a key here. Do you unlock the door? What? 
Oh, okay. What the fuck? This game is very weird sometimes. I'm not gonna lie. There is no handle to open from this side. Okay. So I have to open it from the other side. We have to open it from the left there. This is where I came from. No. Yeah, this is where I came from by Brock. Okay. Well, we have to go this way then. And I think that this goes those goes outside, right? Yeah. Oh shoot, there is a portal there. Can I place half the symbol and then the other half? Or do I have to combine them? And then what? what? Cthulhu Fatagan. Oh, okay. I thought I was gonna unlock it. But you can only go one way. Who's that guy? Saying that shit, bro. We are on caution. We're doing well with ammo. Got a lot of bullets. Ah. I'm gonna leave this here. Right, let's keep going. There is only one way to go. The game is kind of pushing us in this direction. This was Minerva, right? Look at the camera movement. This was the first safe room, I believe. Oh, maybe this was Ezra and the other guy who came here. I forgot his name. Satch. Okay, we can go to the library or we can go to where we found the first zombie. You what, mate? Who's this guy? Get him, boys. I should get out of here. I love Alicia's comments sometimes. Oh, what the fuck? We got a cultist uh, adept. Oh, he's tanky. He's fast too. Hey, you want the shotgun? I give you the shotgun, bro. Fuck you, mate. Kill a follower. Got him. <laughs> so we could go down here. There's more. There's more down there, I think. The other door over there is the is the earth door. <laughs> Hello? Hello, boys? <laughs> Hell yeah, brother! <laughs> Alright, so... We can't leave the library through here. So yeah, we are we're kind of being pushed this way. Let me check back here. Everything looks the same. Oh, I can unlock now the door to the main hall. Okay. Enemies respawn, new kind of enemies. I like it. I like it. I'm gonna try to kill it with the pistol this time. It took two shots, so. 
That one is gonna take a lot of. Oh shit. He gets stun locked, huh? That did not fully heal me. Oh, this is bad. Oh, they have claws for hands. Double kill. I need to heal. I was very scared there because I did have not not have more heals. I was in caution. Um, yeah. Not good. Hmm, I want to go back to... This is the sun. Wait, what? Okay, shotgun ammo. I'll take it. There's a note here. I got a rope here. Guest note. I arrived at the mansion late last night, along with two other fresh members from the program. A man named Robert and his wife, Ezra. <clears throat> they seem just as excited as I was to be here, to see for ourselves the miracles this master speaks of. So far, I have not seen hide nor hair of him, although I have seen a few painted portraits of him, which I must say are quite ghastly, as well as other macabre paintings that are not pleasant to the eye. A macabre painting is on blue. Maybe we need to do something with some paintings. To add to the list of peculiarities is the fact that the mansion seems to be stuck in the early 90s. No electric light, gas ranges and lamps. I hear this man is very old, however. Perhaps he prefers nostalgic eras to the modern, to the modern ones. Eh. I, I, I see. Okay. Let's lock to Minerva. So let's lock to. Let me go back to the safe room. Wait, no, I have to go to a portal. Let me go back to the main hall. This is very cool. Look at Alicia go. Yeah, those followers are tanky. No. Oh. oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, I have to go through here first. Hello? You what the fuck, man? Okay, I'm out. He's fucking throwing axes. I need healing. Like, I'm gonna die. And I haven't saved in so long. I'm scared. Anyone else? Holy! Yo! Wait. Oh, I was gonna say, is the portal gone? I'm gonna kill that guy with the axe. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna save, man. Um, I have a lot of uh, saves, I think. Oh, let's go. Hmm. Hmm. There is this YouTube video about like classic music, but remixed, like mixed to sound more, more like epic. Sometimes it kind of ruins the original piece, but other times it's very epic. If you do like modern orchestra kind of thing, you know? <laughs> and there is one for remote lights, so I think it's like, <laughs> you know? it's very epic. Random room. I don't think I've ever been here before. There is a safe. Uh, 
A warrior holding a shield and sword. Bro, are we supposed to know all these dates and numbers? Like... Nice. Uh, do I have any file mentioning any sword and warrior and a date or something? I don't think so, man. Book. Interior. Gaslight. Source. They're mentioning a lot about the lights. Maybe it's some puzzle has to do with the lights. I'm not sure. Let's go back to the kitchen. I'm hungry. Who's hungry? Oh, there was a door here that we never opened. Maybe that's open now. Hello. Oh, fuck yeah. Bro, what the fuck is this room? It's okay. Dodging pukies. I'm dodging the pukies. See your bullets. And I'm on caution. <laughs> Both doors are locked here. What the fuck? Okay. Nothing shiny. I need to find the other half of the of the moon curse thingy. Let's try to keep track of everything. Maybe it's on the kitchen, on the dining room. This is open too. Let's check this. Hello boys. Hello? Nothing here. What is not blood? Is that a nap or something? Let's check this too. Nothing. Well, this room has the throwing axe enemy. And this guy, so let's kill one fast. Motherfucker. You're next. Oh shit. 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 Oh fuck yeah. Your mama ho. Do you know that? Ah. Fuck you, mate. Eight shotgun shells. I'll take it. Six and little inconsistency and they're not blood code. So like a patch, like fixing bugs and shit. Can I take this axe? <laughs> I like how they don't disappear. Wait, so... Oh, 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 oh. How do I go to the garden, though? Hmm. I don't know what to do now. Oh, it can be one seven ones. No, we can just try that. One, one zero seven one. That one. One zero one seven. Bro, oh, what? Zero. Seven. 
one one zero seven no zero one maybe it's like roman year 171 zero one seven one which one did I not try? 117. Jir <laughs> 7000. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? Did I not try any combinations? I have tried all this. What code is it? Let me see. Holy shit. I think it's the is the only code I have not tried. The only combination. Why does this always happen to me, man? One seven zero one. One seven zero one, and I have written on my notes one seven one zero. Holy fucking shit! <laughs> fucking hell! The shield of faith. Okay, so we can put this on the on the on the CUs. Ugh! How do I get there? This way, I think. So it was those numbers, but. One seven zero one. Okay. They gave us the they gave us the number, but half. I don't know. Like, look at this. It was. It was, one seven. One seven. And then zero one. Like, okay, whatever. I guess you just had to try. I I think I tried literally all combinations, but that one. With okay, Minerva key, Earth key. Okay, with the Earth key, we can open the library one. Where was the other door we could open with Earth key? Hmm. I, I think there were two of them, but one of them I don't remember. Let's check this one here. Bro, I'm getting lost. Holy fucking shit. Camera sometimes. Ceres, so not that one. Hmm. I know it was the library. Maybe it was the next to next to the Minerva one. Bro, my luck, I swear sometimes. No no, it was the one up here. It was the one up here, actually. I just remember. It was this one, right? <clears throat> oh shit oh no it closed behind us the door closed behind us oh hello bro come on you hit me man
So if we go this way... No, we cannot go back. All right, cool. <laughs> Was it 7,000? No. <laughs> a guy with a shield and a sword and shield. Your sir stuff. I mean, if we if we revert our... It's like the, that Einstein quote, right? The, the third... I don't know what the third war fight war war fight will be, but the fourth one will be with stones and spears, right? Or sticks, something like that. Maybe. This guy got it's going too fast, man. Oh shit! Sure. Yeah. Too close. Too close. That's my problem sometimes. I just overthink the puzzle so much that the answer is right in front of my eyes and I don't see it. But to be honest, in my defense, the game presents to you so many puzzles at once that kind of confuses you. This is the first time I take out both of the arms of the zombie. <laughs> okay, so let's go this way. There's a note here. Except from the journal of Dr. Arnold Howard. August 1st, 1981. Incredible. It appears my findings about the script are genuine. One of the members have granted me access to a few of the master's writings after I doubted the claims of his origins being from the ancient European era. The medium appears to be written upon a papyrus, sealed within a plastic protector. I have not seen genuine papyrus scripts since my expedition to the Museum of Egyptian Artifacts in Baltimore. The script appears to share the same style as the engravings on the caps from which they drink their strange mind alerting brew from. I do not have the proper reference text with me to confirm the origin. I'm not even sure a reference text exists for uh, writings prior to 4000 BC, but perhaps I can configure some sort of translation system to help me decipher some of the symbols. We're gonna need that. Dr. Arnold, we need your translation for the symbols, please. Do you unlock it? A large statue of a woman in a thinker stance takes up in the middle of the room. Uh, looks like it, this used to be an art gallery. Oh, it's like the RPD. It's a, it's a, it was a museum, guys. Uh, where does this go? Oh. Okay, second room, but like a back room kind of thing. Hello? Hello? Oh, there's two of them. Ooh. This time I kept shooting because... Uh, last time he just rushed at me and I was like, maybe I don't have time to like run away from him. It's fucking crazy, man. Holy moly! Okay, this room is locked by Earth Key. You have used the Earth Key. Nice. So we unlocked it. And then there is ointment here. I will grab it. I'm pretty sure if I use the heal. No. Let's save it. But I'm very, very low because they bind me already twice. We unlocked it. This one is locked by Minerva. Okay. Let's go this way. I don't I have two options. Oh, this goes back to the main hall. Oh never mind. We're outside. 
We are outside. Actually, I want to go first to unlock the other door. On the main hall. Yeah. Hello. How many? Two. Okay, one down. This one, you're gonna use the knife. I thought I was gonna. I was stuck there for a second. No! Yeah. No! Oh my god. Got him! Oh, here we go. Got the other health. Uh, I thought I not dial tone. Oh, shit. And a call symbol. There's a lot uh, of that around here. A nice fire. Alright, so let's drop this. Let me see. Can I combine this without any glue or anything? I sure can. Nebra Moonsun. Hmm. Okay, so I think that goes for the second floor door. More bolts, more ammo. And we can unlock this. Hell yeah, brother. I'm gonna go to the portal. Wait, what is that? Oh, okay. <clears throat> you dancing? Howard? <laughs> Let's see. We got the earth key. So what I'm going to do is. Oh, there's a portal there, too. I want to go to the library. Yeah. This is kind of a. No, I should not do this. I should not do this. Uh... Or should I? No, no, no. Actually, this is a good idea because I get two objectives in once. I get the Earth Key and then I get the the Moon Sun. Yeah. Wait, can I? I'm not sure if I can get to the Moon Sun from here. Actually, can I? I don't remember. Wait. I think I'm misremembering the location of that door. But at least we get rid of the earth key. And I don't have to carry it around anymore. Okay, we're progressing. We're back on track. We're doing well. After that fucking safe code. Uh, puzzle. Holy shit. Maybe there's one more, there's more earth keys doors later on, but yeah, this is guarded. It is guarded. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> Scare me, man. That sounds so weird, I don't know. Ooh, that guy's gonna wake up, isn't it? Bro, look at these paintings. This atmosphere is on point. This is so cool. Love it. Shotgun ammo. What is this room? A little balcony. Hello, boys. That guy has something, right? He's carrying an item. Oh, there's an item behind him. Oh shit. Oh shit! Nice. 
Nice. Slow down, man. Holy shit, man. This guy's getting juked. There's another one coming! You die. Bro. Is that a strong enemy? I cannot tell. Sounds weird. I'm gonna take the shotgun. Oh, it's a normal puppy. sound they make kind of sounds like strife you know the doom engine game the the follower sounds like the uh, uh, yeah <laughs> i think i know what you mean Imagine if Tamon play this because Tamon likes challenges and he likes knife all the games. There is no fucking way you, you beat this game knife all the way. Need to wait for him to slow down. There you go. Camera? Oh, fuck me up. Oh! Fuck. Don't just. No! <laughs> I didn't want to come here. Oh, triple. Shot in the face. Shot in the face. Dead. Bro, he just clipped down the. F <laughs> he just clipped down the stairs. The oof. Wait. Is this open? Yes, it is. Holy shit, this is a huge room. Room. Oh, so this connects to the balcony where I was coming the other way. Okay. That's cool. Then I'm glad. Uh, I'm not sure. More thumbos. I was trying to get pretty far on knife only in serious sun. How, how far did you get? If the game is 100%, how far did you get? I think I might try Resident Evil 2 no hits runs. I want to save ammo, to be honest. I, I have like two clips. I hear like a big boy behind this guy. Is it like one of those poison guys with the green thingy? Oh shit. Yeah. No more games. It's been a while. I was hoping to uh, the open source release could improve the old engines. Did they not do the open source? Oh, there he is. Got him. What is this? First aid kit. I appreciate it again. Do you see I paused the Talos Principle too on this score? It's coming on November. Okay. Let's see what's over here. So this connects to the door I open from the other side. Okay. And there's a portal here. So let's go to the portal. Let's gather all the items we have left around. Alright, here we go. It's not going too bad today. Two hours and 30 minutes. Nah, I'm gonna continue. A lot more. I'm very hungry though. I may do like a small break for have a quick snack or something. Uh, I'll, today I want to get really far into the game. So today I'm gonna do four or five hours for sure. All right. So we got wait. So th there's just a portal connecting areas. This door. Let's go here. Fuck you, man. Oh shit. 
Oh shit. Yo, what the fuck? I'm in danger. Die, motherfucker. Ooh, that guy's stronger. That guy's like a leader. Angel medallion. This guy stole the medallions from the main door. Most of these paintings looked like they were replaced. Someone took out the beautiful ones and replaced them with grotesque ones. I wonder why. Because for them, it's beautiful. Art is subjective. Bro, those guys were strong, man. That was a trap room for sure. That was a, that was a room that like if you have no heal and no shotgun, bye bye, you know. Bye bye, you know. To be edgy, like I don't die with two shotguns. I survive. Right, we're gonna open this. We unlocked it, and this goes to that corridor upstairs. Okay, this what a mansion. Am I right? What a mansion. This map. This game is huge overall, like the whole game. <laughs> okay, so we got the the angel medallion. I guess we're gonna use that to open the main door again. Where are we now? In this corridor. Yeah. More ointments. Um, scare me. Look at that knife. Look at that knifing. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. We fucking got him. The ammo. Not that, the ammo. Okay. Mm, let's go this way. What is this room, though? Bathroom. Bandage? Another jump scare with the... What is this? Like a mosquito? Like an insect? What is this thing? Oil fix. Ah! Oil fix. Is there something stuck that it needs oil? My ass? I mean, what? <laughs> Dripping some oil. Oh! Okay. Mm -hmm. So... We need the Minerva key. We need to go put the... Bro, where the fuck was that circle thing? I thought it was up there. Oh, it is up there, but it's that room. Okay, okay, okay. But I need to go through the downstairs. Yeah, so I need to go through main hall that way. Okay, right, cool. How do I get back to the main hall? This door. All right, we're gonna do that now. I think, I think that's my only way. <clears throat> Put the moon, the moon sun uh, thingy, and maybe something for the oil. What could be for the oil? The elevator, maybe? No, the elevator needs electricity. What do we need? Hmm. I don't know, man. Okay, we go upstairs. 
put the moon moon sun thingy and i hope we get if we get the minerva key gg and if we get something oh i should have put the freaking angel medallion on the door what? okay so now this is open What was that noise? I have no heals on me, by the way. I just realized. That is not good. All the paintings here depict various types of warfare. Notes. A symbol there, though. Open that shit, bro. Alicia. Two notes here. That's a Minerva key. I need that shit. Alright, let's read the note first. Unknown source note. Translation unavailable. This is the second one we find. The third one? Fourth one? Svastika. Okay. So once we find the translation from Dr. Arnold, we will we will be able to what is she looking at to find what all those things mean strange this cloak is silent whoever lives here probably hates the sound of it that is the same comment she makes on the clock on the portal room. Hmm. Oh, phone ringing. Maybe it's Paul. Maybe it's the master. Uh, hello? Mommy. Is Emily? Mommy, who is this? Emily, is that you? I'm scared, Mommy. Why did you leave me? Emily? Who is this? Where... Where are you? Aww. That's sad. and scary. When is this game's version of Wesker gonna <laughs> show up? I don't know. We need a villain, right? That's true. Like, we have the gatekeeper. We have... Yeah, like, we need, like, a major villain. They have, they have been talking about him the whole game, but we haven't seen him yet. I don't know. I think he should have uh, make an appearance. Maybe he should have called, like, Leon or Resident Evil 4. You know, like, Sattler. Like, hey, yo, what's that? Give you a, a, a phone a phone call, you know? Alright, so we got the Minerva key. Now we can open a lot of doors. <laughs> Let's start with... Where are we? We're there. Um, this one on this room is not the Minerva key, I believe. But it's worth a try. Yeah, this one is Vesta. Let's go back. We have to go... We have to backtrack a little bit for the Minerva key. It's okay. Ba, ba, ba. This one was Ceres, I believe. God, this camera always... Yeah, that one is Ceres, okay. Do I need oil for this? I need to turn be turned back on. Let's put the let put let's put the medallion this time. Can I use that now? Maybe I need the crystal first. I will leave it here. But maybe oof. Can I need that medallion for the puzzle at the cemetery? Do you guys remember that puzzle that you needed for medallions? It could be. It could be for that one. It's 
crazy, man. So that's one Minerva. That's two Minervas. That's three Minervas. No. So it's one, two potentially, and three. Was that Minerva though? I don't remember. I'm gonna check. I don't remember. Uh. So we have to go up and down to the right. This way. This map is so hard to memorize. Holy shit, man. What is this door? You have used the Minerva key, so it was Minerva. Okay. I'm glad I checked this one then. Well, this is a safe room, I believe. They give us shotgun ammo. They give us a record. Um... That's it? There is a note there. Can I read it? There's a fun! Turn the fun on. Uh, whatever. We don't need this. This room is kind of useless. Let's go back. Can I go back through... What if I go there? Downstairs? No. Downstairs, the library, kind of. Oh, let's go this way then. Yeah, we can go through the library and then go down the library ladder and to the right. Yeah, that works too. Everything is kind of interconnected, but still. You want to go from one side of the mansion to the other side of the mansion? Takes a while. The good thing is, I kill everything, so we're chilling now. We have a lot of fighting, but now we're fine. <laughs> Wait, mm, there is another Minerva key here. To the balcony. Let's let's get that one first. I believe it was this door over here. Yeah, and we can also get the one downstairs from here too. So yeah, I think this that's better. It's a better pathing. Uh small room. We got some ammo. Nine bullets. Okay. Oh, this is where we started the game. Kind of? Worker diary. September 14th, 1973. Okay, that was long ago. The master has picked out a new location for us to begin our lives anew. A large sprawling estate featuring a luxury sized mansion on a remote island. No longer will we be living in a squalor hiding in secret among public scrutiny. He says this place will be protected, will be the beginning of a new era, where we can work towards a new future undisturbed. But much work has yet to be done before it is ready to be moved into. He has asked a small group of his most loyal followers with electrical and mechanical experience to begin renovations, renovating the mansion. His requests are very odd. He wants us to strip all the electrical wiring and lighting from inside the mansion but do so in a way that still allows the exterior lights to work. September 18th. This has proven to be much more hard as work than we were prepared for. This mansion truly is massive, and with a group of only four people, we have, we have had to work in a back, breaking 12-hour shifts just to make sure we complete the projects on time. So far, we are about halfway done getting all the electrical components from the, for the interior. It feels like we will never be done with this, but the master assured us our work will be well rewarded in trust i trust him with my life and therefore will continue regardless of how hard the work is september 24th finally we have removed all instances of electrical lights and wiring on the inside of the mansion a monumental feat i took a boat back to the mainland in order to contact the master by phone and tell him we were ready to come back to him 
It was then he informed us that a shipment of paintings will be arriving to the island shortly. And we were in, in, instructed to hang up these various portraits of him in place of the normal paintings that were strewn about the mansion. Wow. I actually quite like the artwork I found here. The previous owners had a good taste in paintings. The last thing any of us want to do is go back and do any more work on the mansion. We are exhausted and sore. But we all sort to obey the master. We'll do as he asks. Why? Work your diary. So, was the Vesta key nice? Was uh, Alicia part of this group? I think she was. And I think all these books are written on English. Most of these books are on electrical engineering. <laughs> was someone here an electrician? So she either was part of the cult. And was convinced to to sacrifice her husband or her daughter or whatever. Mm. Or or she was like second leader or something. Oh, or maybe she's the master. I don't fucking know. That's why we haven't seen him yet. Oh, right, that's all that was here. All right, cool. So we got the Vesta key now too. Let's get rid of the the Minerva key down here. This one. Whoop. This one. All clothes and notes. Keep a drawing. Papa, me, Jumi, 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 the cat, Gra Grandpa, looks like a fucking wizard, a mummy, and a portal, and a sun, and a moon, and a fountain. Yeah. Interesting. He has a name on it, Jume. That's for the cat. A pet color. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, guys. What the fuck is that? Oh. Boo. <laughs> Okay, so we now get we now need to do the Vesta. Vesta key. Vesta key was Ooh, there's wait. Hmm. Uh, down this corridor. There is one door. But that one is locked. Not by any keys, but just locked, I think, right? I don't remember to be honest. Let's check it out. This one over here. Oh, never mind. All right, cool. Shotgun. I'm gonna leave this and the pistol ammo too. Yeah. So there should be one more Vesta key. Oh, hello. This is a normal Tommy. What? What are you? Ball cutters or the chandelier? Oh shit. Fuck you, mate. <laughs> Anything else? Bolts. Okay. So we open this. We got the bolt cutters. Uh, -da -ba -ba. That one was Ceres. And that was not it. But upstairs. Everything upstairs is unlocked, though. So where's the other... What is the other Vesta key door? I don't know, but let's go to the chandelier. Because if the other one is Ceres and the other one is locked, we cannot use the Vesta key yet. That means it has to be somewhere we cannot access yet. 
So I'll, uh, my only option is to do the chandelier. Unless... That's it, right? The back jar... Now the back jar was just locked. There was no key or anything, right? Let me try. Yeah, it's just locked. Um, what was the other breast that door? I remember seeing two of them. I should save soon. I haven't saved in a while. Okay. Still have the oil. Oop. Let's go down there. I still have the ball cutters. Oop. I mean, yeah, we're fine. I just, I'll just leave this here. I won the crossbow game. I wonder if I could, if I had cool gotten the crossbow before when I was on the house. Probably right. I probably could have. Okay, so where is the chandelier room? <laughs> that one. Okay. So the first door to the right. Ba. Boom. Ba. Boom. Ten. Two. First door to the right. It opened a fucking hole on the ground. Oh, hello, boys. Where the where the hell did you come from? No stagger. Oh fucking hell. Little bit of shotgun for you, little bit of pistol for you, little bit of knife for you. We use every weapon in this game. Where did oh shit is running? This member in thumb is here. Oh, we tried. Let me try to cut both of his arm. I like. There you go. <laughs> Got to aim. Usually I aim for the head because I feel like it does more damage. But for the lols. Freaking eyebrow. Well, my head, my head, my eye. Uh, okay. Can I go down there though? Do I need a rope? I could climb down there if I had a rope. <laughs> Barry! 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 I need you. I need a rope. Um, Eternal Darkness. I'm gonna play that game eventually. You have a rogue eyebrow, hairs growing long enough to reach my eye. <laughs> Lobezno. Okay, let me think. Hmm. A rope. And they have the oil. Do you know where I think the rope is? In that small square in the garden with two red doors? I think the rope is there, but I just don't know how to get there. This one is locked, locked. There is no way. It's jammed. A rope. What about the piano, man? Play it again, Jill. Do I need a music sheet or something, maybe?
without their shield, shield of faith. Oh, it's just the same thing. I don't fucking know. Um. Oh, this was the best key. Holy, I'm so glad I tried this then. I knew it, man. Yeah. Oh, lion head. What the fuck? A note. The divine fire. Lol, Lord Alfred has instructed me to unlock the gate leading to the swamp. A very important barrier he has enchanted with a special magic lock. I've been trying all day to unlock it. A series of fires must be laid in order for the lever activated. Each of the six ceremonial fire has a name, which I have now figured out after trial and error. Now I just need to know in what combination they need to be lit. So far I have tried 10 different sequences. The next one I'll do is Ignatia Vesta Fia and Ethne, Netzia Ardere. If that doesn't work, I'm giving up and trying again tomorrow. Only Lord Elfred knows the combination, but he's off in the catacombs and doesn't not want to be disturbed from his work. <laughs> Once that is done, he requires a sacrifice in order for the lever to even be to even be pulled to open the door. I wonder which of the cultists will be used for the task. Divine fire. Uh, what? <laughs> I still have the Vesta key. No, I don't. Bro, game, can you tell me you discarded it, please? Thank you. <clears throat> Imitation of Lion's Head. Watch. Watch. Use it here. Combine. No. Well, the only place I can put the Lion Head is the library. As of now. Wait, 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 wait. Can I use the oil here? Because it says... It gets in slow by some kind of mechanism. But the mechanism is not here. What is the me Oh. The main mechanism seems to unlock the gate. Will you pull the lever? Yes. I'm so fucking glad I saw that lever. I'm so glad I saw that lever. Because otherwise I'll have... Go back to the mansion and wander around. For 20 minutes. Thinking that I could not unlock that. Holy moly. Okay, this door is locked. Let's double check everything. We are we we reached the guy then. Let's fucking go. Finally. Oh, this door is open now. Woo! Let me go here. I want to go to my room. <laughs> this is where we start the game, by the way. This... This room right here. Hell yeah, brother. It was locked. I had to change our clothes. Okay, I need to save. I need to save. I haven't saved in so long. Here we go. Okay. Let me shake all the way down this corridor. Game, okay, please. Thank you. Okay. Back to the garden. There's gonna be more enemies on the garden. 100%. At least there's no dogs. I don't hear any dogs. That's good. Hello? Hello? Nothing here. Huh? So maybe I need to put the lion's head on the fountain again? Why did I do that the first time? Oh, because I need it for the library. Sure. Hello, anyone around? 
Can I open this from here? Okay. We unlock the door to the garden. Great. Cool. That's very good. Big shortcuts. No more enemies? There is only one enemy here? Okay. I check everything, right? Yep. Uh, so... Something can be placed here. Bloop. Oh! <laughs> like the RPD key. So this guy has to be Ceres key, right? Sa Red Sapphire. Holy. Red Sapphire. Oh, because we can go to the garden through this door now, right? I was thinking, like, how the hell do I get out of the mansion in the first place? But well, we have this door. Hey. Hmm. <laughs> Oh shit. What a bitch. Kill all the walkers in the mansion. All of them! I have no heals. It's locked. I'm killing everyone. I am the bringer of death. Oh boys. Do you know why? Do you know why they're giving us that, right? <laughs> and you know what's coming, right? I always, I always bring that my knife with me. Oh yeah, brother. Seventeen bullets. Holy shit. Let's go. All right. Where do I go? W where does this lead to? Over oh, the map. Back to your B. Oh boy. I'm going back. The reason I'm going back is I have no heals. I'm low HP. I haven't saved in a long time. And that looks like... Who? Where? How was that? that or, uh, uh? Yo, what is it, dog? That dog sound was not there before. Is it because we found the, 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 the kid throwing? There is a dog crying on the other side? Is that you, man? Alright, so we're gonna carry this red sapphire and these two. And the heal. Ah, let's go. Wait, am I... Yeah. Wait, can I not put the medallions there? Maybe those I have to put on the other puzzle. And not here anymore. The medallions were taken. Bro, I have them right here. Okay. I guess... Do you, have... Do you either have to put the red light first? Or is for the other puzzle. One of the two. Alright. So we saved the game. What is the quickest way to go where I was coming from? From behind. Okay. Stream for three hours. Easy game. My ass started to hurt. Oh! Here we go. We have the red sapphire. I'm gonna take the fucking shotgun. <laughs> this is a typical corridor that looks like the gatekeeper is gonna come or something. Wait, where the fuck am I? Oh. This way. Here we go. What is this? Oh, I need the lighter. There is a text here. It reads, "Ethne." Oh, Vesta. Okay, so these are the the riddle from the guy. 
Uh, which one was it? The Fire Fire. This one. So I need the lighter. <laughs> yeah. So the fir first one is Ig Ignatius. 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 No enemies, please. Right there. Yeah. This one, right? What note is it? Note Divine Fire. So let's see. Let me write it down so it's quicker. Ignatia Vesta Via Ethne Nestia Artere. Which one is this one? This one is Nessia, which is almost last one. Yeah. I need Vesta now. Arlete is the last one. Yeah. Vesta, so I need this one. Now we need Bia, which is back here, I believe. And then Ethne, which is the first one. Yeah. And then last one. And then back here. Nestia. I'll checking. Uh, this should work. That door is locked. So yeah, we have to lose. And the last one is this one. Is it gonna work? Hell yeah, brother. Saving. I don't like that game. I don't like that. Yo, look at the camera. Wait, why did it move like that before? It moves so cool, so cinematic. It's like. <laughs> swamp. Says so behind my camera here. Says so swamp. I don't like swamps. I mean, let me be honest. I don't like swamps, okay? So, yeah. Yeah. And. Yeah, that's what I think. <laughs> One bullet for like, how many did we get? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I need to use the pistol, man. I had too much ammo. What are you boys doing here? Having a bath? You think this is good, this is good for your skin, man? I should definitely have my knife for this. Right, let's kill this guy. Low though. Oh! What is in here? Oh, there's one. The pukey? Yeah. No pukey's here.
Look at those waves. Holy physics. <laughs> In the team, guys. In the team. Okay? I'm going to... Hard. Bro! I made the fucking wall. Oh, there's another one. Shit. Oh! He tried to look at me. I kind of like them. Wait, what? Is this open? You can't even... You can't even interact with it. Bro, what? I don't understand this sump. I don't understand this sump, brother. Oh, hello. What was that sound? Okay. Bro. Should I have run past all these enemies? Not sure. Oh, the head pop. Shit. Shit. Okay, wait, where do I go? Wait, what? Is this... Is that dead end? Oh, there's something here. Looks like something small and circular can be placed here. What? You what? Hold the phone. Mm. Mm. So we need an item. That item is not on the swamp. Did we ever investigate the service key? I hate that I cannot switch between maps. Select floor. Item navigation. No, I don't want item navigation. I want to search. I want to look at the different map. Not the one I am at. That's all I'm asking for. Okay, so... Bro. Do we ever check that room? I don't remember now. Did I leave the key in the box? Yo, we still have the oil. Oh, the oil could be for... for the kitchen? Let me see. Yeah, we never enter that door. What the fuck am I doing, man? <laughs> I'm living the mansion. Oh, Luna! You don't have to do that. Loon Artist is now a Super Saiyan. Holy... A vampire Super Saiyan? I don't want to face that. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you for the support. I appreciate it. <laughs> Woo Let's go. I'm still going. I'm still going. I want to finish this game. And this game... This game is like... Double as long as, Resi as Resident Evil 1 Remake. Ah, oh, there you go. I want to make more emojis. I want to make one like Giga Chat with my face. I want to do like Pog with my face or something. Or maybe I should do like something with my cat. <laughs> I don't know.
I I appreciate that you guys have any ideas for emojis. I have one for dancing. I like the one for dancing. Or like raving, yeah. Do you have beautiful eyes, by the way? Oh, thank you. Play, Jill. Okay. <laughs> I'll catch you guys next time. I want to finish this game. I believe I'm like 60, 70% done. So we're getting close to the ending. Um, thank you for the sub again, Loon. Thank you, Polygon, for the chatties. And I'll catch you on your stream or your anything you do, uh, Loon. I'll see you next time, okay, guys? Bye-bye. Peace out. Have a good day.